Hey gang, welcome to the Cross-Eyed Texan. My new little piece of technology starts the recording for me before I'm ready. But we are finally going to be doing my final thoughts and final review of this, which is Iris Man by the gentleman, I believe his name is Michael, over at Making Sense. This is, as I stated in a couple other videos, this is his take on the much-loved um, Prada Loam. Um, I'm going to spray some of this on because it's awesome. I don't like Prada Loam in the heat, so I've been wearing this in the evening. Although, about a week ago, we had a, a little bit of a cool spell where I could wear this. But I paid 50 bucks for a 50 mil bottle. And let's go over the notes. First, first, first of all, first of all, okay, type these out directly from his website. And the, the top notes are neroli, black pepper, cardamom, and carrot seeds. Never heard of anybody using that before. That's cool. Middle notes are iris, violet, geranium, and mate. We're going to talk about that in just a second. Never heard of that before either. Base notes are amber, cedar, patchouli, ambergris, and sandalwood. Now... I've never heard of mate. I have no idea what that is. So I got out on the interwebs and did a little research for you guys. It says mate is a fragrance ingredient that can have a variety of uh, different olfactory notes, including green tea. It can, um, it can smell like tobacco. It can... Uh, Create a smoky or herbaceous note. Um, tobacco made also 60% MPG. I'm not sure what that is, ladies and gentlemen. But he goes on. To, but it goes on to say it can be herbaceous. It can be floral, and I think that's where that's that's the note that's given the uh, the, the floral note in here. Um, and it can even. Uh, it can also have a citrus note, but I think that that mate is what's giving this fragrance the, the floral note that it has because it definitely has one. This stuff is so close to um, Prada Loam that I don't think you could tell the difference unless you had them on side by side. Matter of fact, Ross over at TLTG Reviews did it. And he said, aside from the opening, and the opening is a little bit different with five, 15 minutes in, they're indistinguishable. And as far as longevity goes, I put about five or six sprays of this on, and that may seem like a lot. But you have to remember, since this is an extract concentration, it's not going to push off your body like crazy. As far as longevity goes, 12 hours. No problem. Um... I've been testing this in the evening time because it's cool. Um, and I wake up still smelling it. And if you ever wear a fragrance to bed, you know, you, it just kind of rubs off on your sheets and stuff. But I, when I got up and got in the shower the next morning after the very first time I wore this, that water woke it right back up. This is an amazing fragrance. And he's working on some other things that I cannot wait to get a hold of. Um, I don't know if I should tell y'all, so I'm not until I get permission from him to do so. But if you're looking for, I don't want to use the word cheap, but a less expensive alternative to Prada Loam, and you really want to support a small business like I do, I would rather do that than, than just about anything and support a small business. You owe it to yourself to give this a try. You're missing something if you don't give this a try. This is my third uh, bottle from him. I also noticed that he has Iris Man Intense, which is his take on Prada Loam Intense. I'm not even going to bother to get a sample of it. I'm going to order the whole bottle. Because um, if it's half as good as this, I mean, you, you just can't lose. Matter of fact, I'm going to put one more spritz on my arm crotch. These atomizers that he uses are actually very good. They leave a little oil slick on you, man. This is very good. So 
I'll put a link in the description below where you can pick up some of this. I'm looking forward to trying some more of this guy's stuff. It's just amazing. It's a good value. It smells utterly fantastic. It lasts way longer than the EDT ever thought about lasting. And you get to support a small business and something that's made here in the United States. You can't beat that with a stick. So that's my final review on this. Man, get it. You're missing out. You should give it a try. If you like Prada Loam, you'll like this. Take care of each other. God bless you guys. Talk to y'all later.